so we talked at church this morning about what the palms represented and, and how uh, uh, back in the Roman time they used to lay palms on the ground before the victor came home. When the general had won a big battle, that, that's kind of the whole presentation before he marched, you know, marching back into the city victorious, the people would lay down palms and, and give honor to him that way. And so many, and Palm Sunday represents largely the replication that Jesus came back victoriously. Amen. He comes back into the city victorious and the people were honoring him. Amen. But the Lord took me away from that. I thought I was going to preach some more of that. Praise God. But the Lord took me a different place from that. And I see why he did it, brother. Amen. Because God's talking about prayer tonight. Yeah. Amen. How many of you pray on a regular basis? Huh? How many of us pray? And, and do you know what we're doing when we pray? Yeah, what? What are we doing? Go ahead. You said it. And it's right at the hand. From Palm Sunday to Easter Sunday, the, the, what has been so established for me that, you know, sprinkling the blood of Abel through a vacuum, I mean, just telling about mm -hmm. his son Jesus, but he laid everything in 